Hey, this will be a video chart on ticker symbol VDSC. We will take a look at the daily time frame. Done this one multiple times before, but wanted to get it updated here as the chart has started to show some signs of life, both from the price action and volume perspective. So I've had some questions and so forth come in. So I want to get things updated and kind of just map out what's going on and what we want to see happen from the technical perspective. So I already touched on the first couple of things being the volume bar down here and the uh, price reaction that came with it which is good to see now it's just a matter of you know does history repeat itself and what do I mean by that as well this chart has quite a bit of history of big moves up and then you can see there price falling back down now the one big difference between today's action and this example right here is the thing that knocked it down was this purple line up here which is a 50-day simple moving average however when we look back here, you can see that the 50-day did not knock the price down, and in fact, the price closed well up above it. So that's going to give us our first clue and first kind of measuring point to measure how strong this move actually is. You know, lots of lots of one-day wonder moves, but you know, if this thing's got some true gas in the tank and some true momentum behind it, then the measuring point, like I said, is going to be this purple line here, the 50-day simple moving average, and that's valued at double O. 16 that will change as time goes by but for the time being 0016 is going to be the important level that you want to see hold and maintain itself now if it doesn't there is still one more level that we can keep our eye on and that is just the trend line here that we draw right there this has just been simply drawn by connecting these lower lows or excuse me these lows which this that one is obviously higher than that one so this is really the key level of support because as long as the price remains above here, that's going to imply that the price is trending upward. So, you know, if the price were to come back down here, bounce, come back up here, bounce, come back up here, every time every pullback would be a higher low and that's the name of the game. So uh, certainly the 50 day simple moving average is the preferable level that you want to see hold as support. But if it doesn't, the chart still does have this tread line down here that is the must hold level of support. Now in terms of resistance levels, The one that seems to have popped up today is based off of this high right there. Then you can see knocked it down again right there. That level is at 0022. So 0022 is the current level of resistance. But the interesting part about that is if this level is broken, next levels of resistance aren't up until this area up here. And when we're talking about a sub penny stock like this, the percentages can add up very quickly. So lots of room to run up here if it can break through the 0022 area. So for the time being, it's it's the most important question for the chart is, you know, is this a genuinely strong move? So use those two uh, support levels to help answer that question for you. If there are any other questions on the chart, please let me know if not. And you enjoy the video and want to learn more about charting and how to use it in your strategy as a trader. Or if you're looking for some advanced strategies, I'd encourage you to click on the image up above and check out some of our downloadable video courses. They are instant download, so you can literally get started on them today. They've been getting great third-party reviews and testimonials, so I'd encourage you to check them out and give them a try. One more time, this was VDSC. Thanks for listening, and have a good one.